Thanks, Sean. Uh, I, I didn't expect any uh, claps as I came up. I know I'm not the most popular guy at the head table here today. Um, this is, is certainly uh, impressive, uh, being in the game a long time and uh, have never been part of anything like this at uh, midfield in uh, this fantastic stadium. And uh, it's certainly an honor for, for me to be here uh, to represent the Moose Jaw Warriors Hockey Club. Uh, I'd like to congratulate Sean and his committee, uh, Anthony and Todd and the entire Pats organization uh, for what they've announced here today as part of hosting the 100th Memorial Cup. It, uh, you certainly aren't sitting on your hands waiting for the puck to drop in May. Uh, you've put together uh, a real special showcase that will be special for the entire Western Hockey League and, and the Canadian Hockey League. And, it certainly looks like uh, the, one of the best Memorial Cups, if not the best Memorial Cups, will be played here in May. And it certainly will be the best if the Warriors are, uh, are in it with you, which uh, is certainly our goal. Uh, on behalf of our board of directors, uh, Chad Taylor, our president, is here today. Uh, our entire organization and most importantly, uh, our players um, can't say enough about how excited we are to be part of this weekend. I think this will be something that's truly special, uh, truly historic, and truly a once in a lifetime opportunity for our young guys uh, to play here on February the 18th against the Pats. Um, so very honored, very excited uh, for our players, very excited for our fans. Uh, just down the road. I think there will be lots of Moose Javians making the trip down. Uh, this is a great rivalry and uh, certainly will be a very, very special day. So thank you to everyone and uh, it's a privilege to be here and we can't wait till February. Thank you very much. Alan, uh, looking forward to, to taking part in this outdoor game and, and the whole weekend that's going to be happening here in Regina. Wow, we're, th we're thrilled. and. Uh, you know, there was lots of talks in advance of the potential of the game, and uh, uh, we were front and center in talking to uh, the Pats, and that uh, we would love to be part of it. I think, uh, like I said, I, it's, it's a once-in-a-lifetime thing for our players. I, like I, I think these games are special for NHL players. Never mind 16, 17, 18, 19 year old uh, kids. So we're. Uh, we're absolutely thrilled to be part of it. Uh, I think it'll be real special for our players. Um, geography is what it is for our fans to be a big part of it. Uh, I think we can have a lot of fun with it, but for our organization and particularly our players, um, real special and real excited to, uh, to play in this uh, historic game. As you alluded to, uh, obviously, this is happening at a very important time of year and those could be very important points. Um, was it important to you, for you as an organization, are there any concerns with playing an outdoor game and, and did you have to have any concerns allayed in terms of knowing that it was done right? Well, you know, we we knew with the new ownership group of the Pats that uh, and, uh, and what Mr. Semple has done with his committee here and putting this all together that, uh, that it was going to be done right. Uh, we realize that it's an important game. We realize that you know, that's going to be an important two points on the board. Um, but the reality is it's what, whatever the conditions, uh, it's going to be the same for both teams. Uh, we expect with the people they have in place to produce the game, uh, the ice is going to be real good. Uh, you're going to ask uh, the weather to cooperate. But uh, when everything's equal for both teams, uh, and then you do your best to compete and, and try and win the hockey game. Will you guys head outside at all to, to practice to get ready? Uh, <laughs> Any point leading up? Well, we're uh, we're waiting for uh, some details. There's uh, uh, there has been some discussion that there, there may be some availability for us to come in on the Saturday, and uh, and get a skate in. Um, so we're hopeful that that can happen because uh, just stepping on the ice for warm up and getting ready for a game could be pretty intimidating. So we're hoping that there's an opportunity to come in uh, on the Saturday and get a, accustomed to uh, uh, the event. Um, um, but uh, in the meantime, uh, do we have to get out in some rinks and maybe skate Buffalo Pound a little bit again uh, to get ready? Well, we'll, we'll look at every uh, option we have available to us to get ready for this game. 